Tonight we are talking with one of the three Roan County boys rescued from freezing waters over the weekend after they fell through the ice. It happened Saturday on the Little Emery River off Watts Bar Lake in the Blair community of Harriman. The boys were looking for a place to go fishing when the ice cracked and two of them went into the water. A third boy fell in while trying to pull the others out. All three were stuck in that freezing river for about an hour because rescuers had trouble reaching them. Once they were freed, the boys were flown to UT Medical Center. Six News reporter Kayla Strayer spoke with one of the boys today as they continue to recover. She joins us now live in the newsroom. And Kayla, how did he describe this frightening incident? Well, Lori and Jean, the boy Leith Clark, tells me that he's lucky to be alive. All this happened on his 14th birthday. He was celebrating with friends when they decided to walk to the lake near his house, and that's when this incredible story of survival started. Yeah, I pretty much gave up at the end. Leith Clark and his friends were walking on ice at Watts Bar Lake when his two friends fell in. And I guess they stepped on an air bubble in the water and they was near a buoy where the ice wasn't all the way around it. Leith tried to save them. And right before I was going to grab one of their hands, I fell in with them and my cousin was trying to grab my hand and I was swimming toward him and the ice just kept breaking and breaking. That's when his cousin ran to get help. Like all three of us were on a buoy. We just holding for dear life praying. They stayed clinging to this buoy in 35 degree water for nearly an hour and a half. My friend kept screaming and he was wasting his heat and energy and he was getting cold. Leaf's pastor, Neil Crass, arrived on the scene with his boat. The parents, if you could imagine your child uh, just 75, 50 yards away from you and, and watching them cling to life. Uh, to this buoy um, was um, really heart-wrenching. Crass and his son took their boat here where they were able to break through the ice and rescue the boys. When we first got to them, they, they had no response. They, they just had this blank look in their eyes um, of, of just great fear. The boys were immediately flown by Life Star to UT Medical Center. My prayers were answered. I believe God was with us and I can feel him in my heart. to make sure and say how much he really appreciates all the prayers and everyone who came together to help bring him and his friends to safety. He says they will be staying away from ice from now on. And other than a little numbness, he says he and his friends are feeling much better today and they should be back in school tomorrow. On your side, live in the newsroom, Kayla Strayer, 6 News. All right, thank you, Kayla. What a mature young man. Now, all three boys were discharged from UT Medical Center on Sunday morning.